Welcome to today's video about 12 herbal teas that clean arteries and lower high blood pressure. What if the secret to a healthier heart was hiding? In your cup? Ever been curious about those ancient herbal blends that have been whispered through the ages? Can they truly combat modern heart woes? In a world where our hearts are under constant siege, could nature have already provided the arsenal we need to fight back? Today, we'll uncover the mystery of herbal teas that claim to clean arteries and lower high blood pressure. But wait. Before we steep into this enigmatic brew, hit that subscribe button. Trust me, you don't want to miss the revelations we're about to pour out. Just a quick reminder, the information provided in this video is for educational purposes only and is not intended as a substitute for professional medical advice. Now, let's start our countdown with number one, hibiscus tea. Hibiscus tea is not just a pretty ruby red drink. It's a health superstar. The magic lies in its phytochemicals. Anthocyanins, those brilliant pigments that give the tea its red hue, aren't just for show. They've been linked to arterial health, helping to keep those blood highways smooth and clear. But wait, there's more. The tea is also rich in organic acids like hibiscus acid and hydroxycitric acid, which are potent in battling hypertension. So when you sip on this tea, think of it as a gentle nudge to your blood pressure, urging it to stay within healthy limits. Want to brew a cup? It's simple. Steep dried hibiscus petals in boiling water for about five minutes. Strain and enjoy. You can even add a hint of honey or lemon. Most research suggests one to two cups a day can do wonders. However, a word of caution. While hibiscus tea is generally safe, Overconsumption might lower blood pressure too much or interact with certain medications. Always check with your doctor, especially if you're on meds or pregnant. According to a 2010 study in the Journal of Nutrition, regular consumption of hibiscus tea significantly reduced blood pressure in pre-hypertensive and mildly hypertensive adults. Now isn't that a fun fact to share at your next tea party? Next, number two, olive leaf tea. Olive leaves are more than just the unsung heroes behind the olive fruit. They're packed with beneficial compounds that can give your heart a health boost. Oluropine, the star compound, is not only a powerful antioxidant, but also has anti-inflammatory properties. This dual action can help reduce arterial plaque and ease blood pressure. But wait, it doesn't stop there. Hydroxytyrosol and luteolin, also found in olive leaves, further assist by protecting blood vessels and reducing inflammation. Fancy brewing some? It's simple. Steep dried olive leaves in boiling water for about five minutes. Sip about one to two cups daily for best effects. But remember, balance is key. Overdoing it can cause stomach discomfort or even more severe side effects in some folks. As always, before making it a regular affair, have a chat with your doc. And for those who love numbers, a study from the Journal of Medicinal Food, 2011, reported a significant drop in blood pressure among participants consuming olive leaf extract. Isn't it incredible how nature always has a remedy up its sleeve? Next, number three, celery seed, tea. Celery seeds are a tiny treasure trove of beneficial compounds. Chief among them is three in buttle phthalide, a compound that relaxes the muscles in and around the arterial walls, creating more space and allowing blood to flow with ease. This in turn can lead to a drop in blood pressure. Pretty neat, right? But wait, there's more. A study from the Journal of Medicinal Food, 2013, also points out that celery seeds have antioxidant properties that help combat oxidative stress, a major villain behind arterial damage. Making this magical potion is easy. Boil a cup of water and add a teaspoon of crushed celery seeds. Steep for 10 minutes, strain, and sip away. But moderation is key. Start with one cup a day and always consult with your healthcare provider. However, it's not all sunshine. Overconsumption can lead to dehydration due to its diuretic effect. And if you're pregnant, take a pause. Celery seed tea might not be your cup of tea as it can interfere with pregnancy. To all you health enthusiasts out there, isn't it astonishing how nature provides? Give celery seed tea a try, but always with knowledge and care. Cheers to well-informed choices. Next, number four, lavender tea. When you think of lavender, relaxation probably comes to mind, right? But did you know this aromatic herb can potentially benefit your heart? Let's unpack the magic inside that purple flower. Lavender brims with antioxidants like linalool and rosmarinic acid. These compounds don't just make your tea aromatic. 
They help combat oxidative stress, which plays a role in hardening arteries. A study from Phytomedicine Journal, 2018, found that lavender's compounds can reduce arterial stiffness. Another bonus? They might help in dilating the blood vessels, leading to potential blood pressure reduction. Cool, right? To make this beneficial brew, steep dried lavender buds in hot water for 5 to 10 minutes. Remember, the longer you steep, the stronger the flavor. Aim for 2 to 3 cups a day, but moderation is key. While lavender tea is mostly safe, drinking in excess might lead to constipation or headache. Always listen to your body. Lavender isn't just a pretty flower. It's a cup full of potential benefits. So the next time you're sipping that fragrant tea, know you're doing a little something for your heart. Cheers! Next, number five, lemon balm. Tea, lemon balm, known scientifically as Melissa officinalis, is not just a fragrant herb. Its potential benefits to our cardiovascular health have piqued the interest of scientists worldwide. So what's the magic behind this? It's in the chemistry. Lemon balm contains flavonoids, polyphenolics, and triterpenes. Research, like the one published in the Journal of Nutrition 2014, highlighted that these compounds have antioxidant properties. They combat oxidative stress, which can damage our arteries, making them prone to blockages. Moreover, rosmarinic acid, another compound in lemon balm, has been found to exhibit anti-inflammatory effects, as per a study in the Journal of Ethnopharmacology 2017. Inflammation is a significant contributor to high blood pressure and arterial plaque buildup. Now, curious about how to harness these benefits? It's simple. Add a teaspoon of dried lemon balm leaves to a cup of boiling water. Let it steep for five minutes, strain, and enjoy. While there's no one-size-fits-all dosage, two to three cups a day is commonly suggested. However, always remember that moderation is key. Side effects are rare, but can include nausea, vomiting, or abdominal pain if consumed in excess. Remember, while lemon balm tea offers these promising benefits, it's essential to pair it with a balanced diet and regular checkups. Next, number six, oregano tea. Did you know that oregano isn't just for pizza? Oregano is rich in antioxidants like rosmarinic acid and thymol, which neutralize harmful free radicals. These free radicals can damage arteries and lead to atherosclerosis. Moreover, research suggests these compounds may have vasodilatory effects, promoting better blood flow and potentially helping to lower blood pressure. A 2017 study published in the Journal of Nutrition pointed out that carvacrol, another active compound in oregano, possesses anti-inflammatory properties. Inflammation plays a critical role in high blood pressure and arterial blockage. By combating this, carvacrol adds another layer of protection for our heart. But how do you unlock the benefits of this herb? It's simple. Pour boiling water over a tablespoon of dried oregano leaves and let it steep for 5 to 10 minutes. Strain and enjoy. While it's generally safe for most, moderation is key. Stick to 2 to 3 cups a day. However, like everything, there could be side effects. Some might experience stomach upsets or allergic reactions. Next, number 7. Cat's Claw Tea. Cat's Claw is packed with beneficial compounds. It contains oxindole alkaloids, which in some studies showed immunostimulating properties. Then there are plant sterols and antioxidants that aid in reducing inflammation and enhancing DNA repair. Remember, chronic inflammation is a player in heart diseases. Quinovich acid glycosides in cat's claw have been highlighted for their anti-inflammatory and antiviral attributes. A study published in the Journal of Ethnopharmacology, 2001, pinpointed that cat's claw extract demonstrated vasodilation properties. This means it helps relax and widen blood vessels, potentially easing high blood pressure. Making cat's claw tea is simple. Boil a cup of water, add a teaspoon of the dried herb, let it steep for 5 to 10 minutes, strain, and enjoy. A cup daily is commonly recommended. But remember, everyone's different. It's always best to consult with a health expert about what's right for you. Generally, it's well tolerated. However, some might experience dizziness, nausea, or diarrhea, pregnant or breastfeeding. It's a no-go for you. Next, number eight, Hawthorne tea. Hawthorne's magic lies in its vast array of bioactive compounds. For instance, it's rich in flavonoids like vitexin and quercetin, which are linked to heart protection. Proanthocyanidins, another group of antioxidants present, 
are believed to help in widening blood vessels and improving blood flow. According to a study published in the Journal of Herbal Pharmacotherapy in 2002, these compounds, among others, collectively help reduce high blood pressure and clean arteries. How to brew this heart-friendly potion? Simply steep one to two teaspoons of dried hawthorn berries or leaves in a cup of boiling water for about 10 minutes. Strain and enjoy. However, don't rush. While the benefits are enticing, moderation is key. Typically, one to two cups a day is the suggested amount. But remember, herbs can interact with medications or have side effects. For instance, high amounts of hawthorn might cause dizziness or an upset stomach. Next, number nine, nettle tea. Nettle tea is derived from the stinging nettle plant. Not just a pesky weed, nettles are a powerhouse of nutrients. Key compounds in nettles like quercetin and beta cytosterol can have heart protective effects. Quercetin is an antioxidant that reduces inflammation, potentially preventing plaque buildup in arteries. Meanwhile, beta cytosterol has been linked to lowered cholesterol levels, a win for your arteries. A 2019 study in the Journal of Ethnopharmacology even showed that nettle extracts can relax blood vessels, aiding blood flow. This implies a potential role in managing high blood pressure. Wondering how to prepare this magical brew? It's simple. Add a tablespoon of dried nettle leaves to boiling water, steep for 5 to 10 minutes, and enjoy. A cup a day could be beneficial, but always remember, moderation is key. However, before you rush to sip, bear in mind nettle tea isn't for everyone. Overconsumption might cause an upset stomach or even a rash for some. Next, number 10, rooibos, tea. First off, rooibos tea is a goldmine of antioxidants. A major one, quercetin. Studies like one in the Journal of Cardiology 2019 highlight its potential in improving heart health by increasing good cholesterol and reducing bad cholesterol. Another star compound, aspilathin, has a special knack for balancing blood sugar potentially benefiting those with hypertension. Both these compounds work hand-in-hand, hand, promoting better blood flow and preventing arterial blockage. Now, brewing the perfect cup? Easy peasy. Just steep a teaspoon of rooibos leaves in boiling water for about five, seven minutes. Sip and enjoy. Most people can safely drink several cups a day, but as always, moderation is key. But here's a heads up. While most folks tolerate rooibos well, some might experience headaches or increased liver enzymes. If you're on medication, a chat with your doc is a good idea. And remember, this tea is not a miracle cure. It's a companion to a balanced lifestyle. Next, number 11, chamomile tea. Chamomile is more than just a bedtime soother. This tiny daisy-like flower packs compounds that can potentially be a game changer for heart health. One of its star players is apigenin, an antioxidant that helps relax blood vessels. A study in the journal Molecular Medicine Reports, 2018, suggests that apigenin can protect the heart by reducing inflammation and oxidative stress. But wait, there's more. Chamomile also contains a bouquet of flavonoids, sesquiterpenes, and antioxidants. These compounds combined might help in enhancing heart health. Now let's get brewing. For a heart-healthy cuppa, Simply steep a tablespoon of dried chamomile flowers in hot water for about five minutes. Drink it up twice daily. But like everything good, moderation is key. Overconsumption might lead to nausea or even allergic reactions in some. Next, number 12, dandelion tea. Dandelion tea, derived from the Taraxacum officinale plant, is packed with bioactive compounds. A study from the Journal of Ethnopharmacology, 2016, highlighted the potential of compounds like taraxasterol and chlorogenic acid in dandelion for their diuretic effects. By increasing urine production, they help reduce the fluid in your circulatory system, thus potentially lowering blood pressure. But how does it cleanse the arteries? The antioxidant properties of dandelions, thanks to compounds like flavonoids, can combat oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is a key player in artery plaque buildup. By reducing it, we're keeping our arteries cleaner. Preparing dandelion tea is simple. Boil fresh or dried dandelion leaves and roots in water for about 10 minutes, strain, and sip away. One to two cups daily is typically safe. But remember, moderation is key. While dandelion tea is generally safe for most, it can cause allergic reactions in some and interact with certain medications. And as the sun sets on our tea journey today, remember, every cup holds a story, a tradition, and maybe a touch of heart magic.
If today's brew stirred your curiosity, give us a thumbs up and share the warmth with your friends. And hey, don't wander too far. We've got more steamy tales coming your way. So hit that bell icon and stay t-tuned.